I am Dr. Mahendra Verma, Senior Lecturer in Zoology, Sri Chaitanya Education Institutions, Vijayawada. Now, I would like to share some important tips that enables you to score maximum in board zoology examination. Then, how to score maximum or how to get centum in zoology? I would like to express two important tips. First one is preparation. That is the preparing your subject within a very short stipulated time. Second one is presentation of this in the examination. So, keen preparation and excellent presentation. These two are very, very essential to impress the examiner. Now, how to prepare? First thing, right. <clears throat> so, there are total eight chapters are there, isn't it? Then we have to start our preparation with which topic? According to weightage, we have to give preference. If you observe this weightage marks, maximum score is there on two topics. First one is the biology and human welfare and second one ecology and environment. Both are carrying almost same weightage 14 each like this. So, better to start with either this topic or this topic because they are carrying maximum score of 14 each. Biology and human welfare 14 mass 2 plus 4 plus 8 that is there is a one essay answer long answer question is there and one very short and one short answer question. As second chapter ecology and environment is also carrying 14 mass. So, first of all we have to give more priority to either this topic or this topic. After this Periplanta Americana cockroach is carrying <coughs> say more weightage. So, after completion of these two topics better to concentrate on the cockroach because it is carrying total 12 marks that is the one 8 marks question is there. Then one short answer. Then finally, ecology and environment this is a dry topic but <coughs> one advantage is there with this uh, cockroach. Here either 4 mark question or 8 marks question we need not require any diagrams. So, people who are say afraid of diagrams then they be better to prefer this topic that is the ecology and environment. So, we have to follow this order first one is the biology human welfare second one is the ecology and environment next one the cockroach after this we have to focus on the structural organization animals that is the tissues. So, we have to follow a particular what call the sequence so that within a short span of time we can cover maximum say <coughs> cover syllabus. Now, come to the question paper there are three sections are there section A, section B, section C we know that section A carries 10 very short answers questions and here we have to attempt all the 10 that is carrying 20 marks very crucial and if you focus on this those who study a little bit uh, concentrated you can score maximum 10 out of 10 means almost 20 marks you can score here. Then one thing while you are answering see this one your answer must be either in two words or two sentences minimum. Suppose sometimes the answer may comprise of a single word for example, what is the larval form of a typical echinoderm? The answer is only one word, but better to add one more larva also. Even though the question is actually asking only one larva, better to take one more example. Because these are the two mass questions, better to represent the question, each question in two words. Right? Like this, we have to answer all this one. Second one is the short answer questions 4 marks <coughs> out of 8 we have to attempt 6 questions that is 24 while you are answering this in zoology one question is based on the diagram especially cockroach mouth parts or paramecium or even the euglena diagram while you are drawing the diagram use entire sheet complete sheet answer sheet do not write anything on that sheet except the diagram. After completion of diagram better to label the diagram 
only on one side right suppose there are so many parts are there and see all the parts must be there on one side so that it appears very nice and one more thing is while you are <coughs> answering this question four marks question better to answer in the point wise because minimum four to eight points are needed to answer this question so that the valuer he will easily catch the point don't write in the form of a, a complex paragraph better to represent in the form of point wise so that we can impress the examiner then with reference to eight marks questions <coughs> out of three we have to attempt two definitely in first year one question will be there on the life cycle there are five ss are there with regards to life cycles you must prepare all the five right then periplet americana there are some diagrams are there for example diastole system of cockroach respiratory system of cockroach very difficult circulatory system of cockroach still also difficult those who are not <coughs> experts in drawing the diagrams better to go for ecology and don't think that if you attempt ecology will you get good marks yes 100 percent but thing is for presentation to maximum score in ecology because you need not require any diagrams better to explain the answer in the form of point wise if you fulfill all points definitely you will get 8 out of 8 no hesitation is it okay then <clears throat> one more thing i would like to express is whether it is a periplanta americana or human health and disease doesn't matter all of your answers are one and same for example describe the life cycle of plasmodium in mosquito interstate everybody will write the same thing I mean, how to impress your examiner that's why before starting the examination before starting the answering the question at least write two or three sentences on your own which are not there in your prescribed materials for example describe the life cycle of plasmodium in mosquito don't start the essay starting directly from mosquito life cycle write a few general points related to the plasmodium for example plasmodium is a protozoan parasite it is a diagenetic parasite its primary host is female anaphras mosquito and secondary host is human being like this a few introductory uh, sentences are very much <coughs> needed so that you will definitely impress it by the examiner and even the essays better to express in the form of points wherever you come across any technical word or side heading better to underline them better to highlight it this is more important because the valuer is not having patience to go go through entire <coughs> your description so we have to highlight our point so that automatically it attract the attention of the examiner you will get good score isn't it so that's why a wise preparation and excellent presentation is these are the two key say points to score maximum in the zoology right so first of all we had attempt 10 marks question so that you can score maximum 20 marks next you have to go for four marks question definitely there is one diagram based question is there you will leave one page for this uh, a neat illustration then you have to write the rest of the things in the point wise when while selecting the say, essays eight marks question be careful if you are good enough in drawing the diagrams better to select the diagram based questions if not better to focus on the ecology and environment generally there is no need for uh, diagrammatic expressions so better to express in the form of points so if you follow all these steps definitely you will get good score in zoology let us see one example based on the diagram for example draw a neat label diagram of euglena if this is the question first use one entire sheet and draw the diagram representing the euglena let you have to label the diagram like this starting from anterior to posterior you have to write all the parts one by one and keep all the parts on one side this is the cytostome leads into cytopharynx 
that finally leads into the reservoir. On the wall of reservoir, there is a, a dark red colored pigmented structure is there. This is the stigma. Opposite to this stigma, on the long flagellum, there is a one more structure is there. This is what you call paraflagellar body. This is the paraflagellar body. Next, this is the vacuole. And these are the chromatophores. the chlorophyll bearing bodies, this is the central located nucleus, with the outer body cover pellicle, this is the cytoplasm, which is further differentiated into an outer ectoplasm. and uh, inner endoplasm. After labeling all these parts, find here to write the scientific name of this organism that is the Euglena viridis. So, this is the a diagram based question. If you draw this diagram clearly and if you label all the parts clearly, so that definitely will get 4 out of 4 maximum score is possible. Ok students, so in the come, when we prepare Kavali, we present child job kunnam, one year chadiyan taravata, just 3 hours man correct ga presentation cheka pote, marks rao, kabate preparation in the mukhyam ho, exam lo presentation kuda ante mukhyam. Diniki manak kaos in the intent concentration. While you are answering the question, you must maintain your mental balance. Kabate, your exam was stable ga answer correct ga present chegal gite, work a maximum score of stundi. Adi board exam in a kawatsu, leda a competitive exam in a kawatsu. And moreover, after completion of your answering the all questions, 3 hours in a particular man definitely spare time on to untundi. Time okala migilte venter and paper riches rakandi. Okasari me rasin osar quick osa revive chess condi. Ekadan tapul nayo, let them miss a endo, let them skip a endo, let the inka time on te akarakada highlight chandi. So each ever idim shall kuda manamo, correct a proper go pench kunte, mana paperu, inkunta track to a canapestundi. As the exam starts, the margin of sketch pit is a line that is attractive. And the answers are in order. If you have a formal order, you can follow the same order. If you have a formal order, you can follow the same order. You can follow the same order. You can follow the same order. So, if you have a stable answer, you can check the same order. Okay, let's miss the time to complete the chess. So, these tips are followed. The exam will be completed in the maximum score. If you want to know the exam, you can do the exam. Okay, students. Thank you very much. Okay, students. Thank you very much. And I really appreciate our management to give this opportunity to say, to deliver all these uh, tips to my students throughout the state. So, thank you very much. Thank you very much, sir. So, all the best. Good luck.